Discussion is growing tonight about COVID-19 and Halloween, which is a very social holiday. Old Colorado City just announced the cancellation of its popular store to store trick or treating event. Bill Folsom asked about that decision to cancel. He's live with some answers tonight. Bill. Yeah, there is still a whole lot of uncertainty going on with the pandemic and that popular trick or treat event. It brings crowds here to old Colorado City, so the merchants here well, they decided it best to err on the side of caution. It was a rough decision after COVID's already made it a tough year for retailers. Old Colorado City stores rely on foot traffic and the Halloween event brings a whole lot of it. They also don't want a canceled event to give the idea it means closed. So the district's unofficial mayor stepped up today to say they'd like to see people in costumes on Halloween, but really they don't want them shoulder to shoulder and in crowds. Unfortunately, with the situation at hand, and the tenuous nature of getting large numbers of people together and distribution of candy, we have to call a halt. We need uh, all of the community to be engaging in how we can um, achieve that with potentially some innovation and um, you know, just making some good decisions for ourselves, but also for the community. So El Paso County Public Health Medical Director Dr. Robin Johnson says to think how Halloween can be celebrated differently this year. People have gained prevention wisdom for six months now and she says she's seeing people being smart and creative and making things like Halloween happen in more COVID safe ways. So county health leaders also bring up that people need to be cautious about jumping to conclusions when they hear of cancellations or things happening in other big cities. They are looking at our local numbers. They're looking case by case. So you're going to see some cancellations. You're going to see a lot of things modified. And uh, also they're saying use your common sense. Look at the numbers. Be wise. Keep yourself safe. Watching out for you at Colorado Springs. Bill Folsom, News 5.